Hey guys, here's the number one question everybody's been asking me today. Will my home still sell if I need to move, even though there's coronavirus right now in the area? Stay tuned. No need to panic. There's no need to panic. I'm going to go over with you guys the current market condition in the DC metro area. As of today, I'm going to go give you some statistics so you know exactly what's going on, and you can also I'm going to give you some some tips on how to prepare and put yourself in the best position if you need to move. Now I'm going to give you some tips on what to do, and if you're looking to buy, I'm going to give you some tips on making sure that you get the best deal possible. But let's start with the current market condition. You guys ready? Current month, March 2020, our current inventory is 8,645 homes currently on the market. I wanna start with that. I want you to know that number's kinda low. If you compare that to the number we had last year, last March, that number was over 13,000, almost 14,000 homes in inventory on the market. So what does that mean if you're a buyer looking to buy today? If you're a buyer and you have a deadline, you say, John, I got to move by the end of the month. I got to move in April. What does that mean for you? It means you have less homes to choose from. It also means that you better put yourself in the best position possible to find the right home, but also to make sure that you have all your financials in place to win out because I can give you this assurance. You're probably because of the number of inventory on the market, the number of homes currently on the market in inventory, you're probably going to encounter multiple offers. And so it's so important if you're going to be encountering multiple offers that you put yourself in the best position to win and that you're working with the agent that's gonna help you win, all right? So if you're thinking to yourself right now, John, what does that mean? What do I need to do to put myself in the best position to win out if I'm looking to move in today's market, the first thing you need to do, number one, get yourself pre-approved. I know I sound like a broken record, but that is the most important thing. If you want leverage and you want to be able to beat out other buyers and you have multiple offers, it's so important that you have your financials in place, that you know exactly how much you can afford, that you know exactly uh, what your payment look like, that you know your ceiling, that you know what your comfort number is. And number two, that you get access to all the best homes before the average buyers ever sees them. Because of the days on the market, how long it's taking homes to sell currently, we're currently seeing a lot of homes go on the market and going under contract rather fast. And some of you are thinking to yourself right now, that's exactly my situation. So if you're encountering multiple offers and you're seeing that the best homes you want are already under contract before you even had a chance to take a look at them, the second tip I can give you in today's market, March 2020, is to make sure you work with a team or an agent who can give you instant access to all the best deals, including homes that are not yet on the market, what we call in this industry as coming soon homes. It used to be called pocket listings. It could be a pocket listing, it could be a coming soon, whatever it is, you need to work with somebody who has access to that and can give you access to all those homes that are not yet on the market so that you can beat out all the other buyers and you can give yourself the best shot of winning out. Now, if that's what you want, let me know. I can give you access to all these homes as well. All right, let's continue with the statistics. Number two, the average list price. The average list price on the market today is $872,987. That's important because what you need to know is compare that number to what the number was last March 2019, that number is actually 23% higher than where it was last year. What does that mean? If you're a homeowner, potentially what that means is 
your home may be worth a lot more than you think. It may be time to get your value, your equity, evaluated. Double check. Find somebody that you trust, an agent who knows how to sell homes, who has all the buyers. Get that person to come meet you at your house and evaluate how much equity you actually have in your home. So that's what that means. Another thing is the median list price currently, March 2020, is $595,000. If you look at the number, compare that to 2019, that's actually 13% higher than it was last year. So if you look at the average list price and you look at the average, the median price, both are indicating that it's going up. All right, so that's really important. Again, if, you're, if you own a home, this might be a good time to sell Number one, because inventory is down, the levels are down, the prices are up. The simple law of economics is that when there's high demand and low supply, prices go up. And that's what we're seeing in today's market. The number of new listings coming on the market uh, month to date is the middle of March right now. The number currently is at 4,322. We have seen 4,322 homes come on the market in the DC metro area in the first half of this month. That number is about the same number as it was last year. Last year and for the full month of March, we had 8,895 homes come on the market. So we're seeing about the same trend of the number of homes coming on the market, except by this time last year, there were 5,000 more homes on the market currently. So current buyers last year had many more choices starting out the month and this month, 2020, you're going to have still, even though we're on the same number of homes coming on the market, the number of homes currently in inventory is much less, meaning that buyers, you're probably going to have to compete and you need to find an agent who knows how to negotiate for you, who knows how to win out for you, and who knows how to put you in the best position financially and also access to all the best homes so that the average buyers, so that you can beat out the average buyers and homeowners. What this means for you is your home may be worth a lot more than you think. This might be the season for you to dream, okay? So it might be the right time for you to get an equity analysis. Talk to one, one of my agents, talk to me. We are more than happy to come out to your home and get your, uh, your property, your home evaluated and find out what it's currently worth, what a buyer is probably gonna be willing to pay if you decide to move this season, okay? Here's what I'm trying to tell you. There's no need to, to panic. Homes are selling. Inventory is low, prices are still going up, okay? I will, of course, I will keep you up to date as more statistics come out. I'll make sure to let you know what's happening in the market as we continue throughout this quarter, throughout this month, throughout this year. So if you are a home buyer and you are currently looking to buy and you are afraid to go look at houses, here's what we have to offer you. We are currently offering a virtual consultation with our team members so you don't have to leave your home. We'll do everything virtual, online. We'll do a consult for you. And if you're a homeowner, we'll do the same exact thing for you as well. And when it's time for you to look at houses, and let's say that you don't want to leave the comfort of your home, and you're afraid with the coronavirus currently out there, what we can do for you is we can give you a virtual tour of each one of these homes. You let us know which homes you want to look at. You let us know which features are important to you. And I'm, one of my team members will go out to the home and what we can do is we can film the home for you. We can do a FaceTime or a Skype chat while we're giving a tour of the home. And as you let us know, hey, John, we really love the backyard. Can we see the backyard? We'll make sure that our one of my agents will go out to the backyard and will give you a virtual tour of the backyard in real time. So you're letting us know which part of the home you wanna see, and we'll give you a virtual tour of the home in real time, not pre-recorded, so you can still communicate as if you're getting a tour of the home.
Some of you know that we are currently on a mission to provide 3,000 meals by the end of this month, by the end of March 2020. So guess what? I want to give you an update of where we currently are, but I want to first start out with giving a couple of shout outs to some amazing people, amazing friends of mine, clients of mine, who's recently referred us to their friends. So first off, I want to say thank you to Dr. Peter Kim out there in California for referring us to two of your friends, two of your uh, close friends who are doctors who are moving to the DC metro area. Dr. Kim, thank you so much for referring us and connecting us. We'll make sure to get to give them the best service possible, the same award-winning service that we always provide to all of our other clients. And I also want to give a big thank you and shout out to Valerie and to Andy for giving us an opportunity to help one of their clients out who's thinking of selling and buying in the near future, also in the DC metro area. Again, guys, if you are thinking of making a move in the near future, or if you know anybody who's thinking of making a move in the near future, please connect us. I would love for an opportunity to give the same award-winning service to you, to your friends, to your coworkers, to your family members, and make sure that whatever their needs are is met, and we wanna make sure that we, that, that we uh, that we don't overpromise, but we over deliver in everything that we do. Guys, every home that we sell in 2020, we are donating a portion of our income so that we can change lives through real estate. And we're for every home that we sell, we're feeding families, we're feeding people who are hungry, and we are on a mission to end childhood hunger in our community in 2020. So guys, here's the current statistics. A month to date, Again, our, our goal is 3,000 meals provided, given back from our team by the end of this month. And right now, we're at 2,600 meals that so far this month we can provide thanks to you guys, thanks to our loyal VIP following who's always, always helping us out, giving us referrals, letting the world know about our award-winning team and our award-winning service. Hey guys, here's where you can help. We still need 400 more meals to provide to these families. So if you know anybody else thinking of making a move, this would be a great opportunity to connect us so that, again, you guys can play a role in making sure that we hit our goal, our target goal together of feeding 3,000 people, 3,000 meals by the end of March 2020. Thank you guys for helping out. So I hope this has been helpful. Thank you so much for watching this video. We'll be releasing more videos every single week. If you want to stay up to date with what's going on in the real estate market, any tips that we are providing, please click on subscribe. Thank you so much. Have a great day.